It's a quirky rom-com that burst onto the silver screen almost 20 years ago. But what if I told you that Legally Blonde, yes, that Legally Blonde with Reese Witherspoon, like totally had a major impact on the legal profession. I'm Itai Had with a story of one woman who says Elle Woods changed her life, and she's not the only one. She wears hot pink lip gloss, has cascading blonde hair, and a rose-colored laptop. At first glance, she looks a lot like a certain bubbly sorority girl from Bel Air who one day decided to go to Harvard Law. I'm Elle Woods, and this is Breezer Woods, and we're both Gemini vegetarians. Meet Layla Summers, a Scorpio vegetarian and a family law attorney who says Elle Woods was a driving force behind her decision to go to law school. When I saw the movie, I just felt it gave me like a, a real surge of motivation because I really identified with her. Her Instagram profile is Legally Blonde 1978. She's watched the film more times than she can count, and she feels comfortable using the movie's jargon in everyday life. What, like it's hard? <laughs> it might seem a little odd that a campy comedy like Legally Blonde could have that kind of effect on anyone, let alone a serious lawyer specializing in domestic violence cases. After all, Elle Woods is not your typical heroine. I object. I just love the idea of, you know, that you can be yourself. You don't have to fit into some sort of female stereotype. A quick search on social media shows Layla is not alone. Elle Woods literally inspired me to go to law school, wrote one lawyer. Another wrote, ditto, except I'm not blonde. I totally love the in the two decades since its release, Reese Witherspoon's iconic law school comedy has grown up from hilarious hit to serious inspiration. The movie is fun and cute and playful, but there's more to it than that. And that's, I think, what the movie is really about. In 2016, for the first time, more women were admitted to law school than men. But female lawyers are still a minority in the courtroom. Only 35% of lawyers and 20% of partners at U.S. firms are women. So I think the movie is still very relevant. Just being a girl and being a woman, you're, the odds are stacked against you still, even in 2019. The good news, there'll be a lot more Elle Woods in Layla's future. A third installment of Legally Blonde comes out in 2020. When I watch the movie now, I just feel like I'm part of a great club of um, powerful professional women like a sorority. Oh, I have a point, I promise. Then make it. In other words, under all that pink and blush and legally blonde is a strong feminist message that's persuaded countless women to embark on the journey to become a lawyer. Order, order. Proving the old adage, you can't always judge a book by its cover.